Ah, hello Rexburg, and Merry Christmas. We wanted to share a little bit of Rexburg drama from us to you. I hope you enjoy. This week on Rexburg Drama. We got some issues at the house. Last night I came home to find a caffeinated drink in the fridge. Not in my house. All right guys, apartment council. Whose caffeinated drink is in the fridge? Wasn't me, I didn't touch any caffeine. I don't know what you're talking about, bro. Matt, we all know you have the soft spot for the caffeine. Do you want me to bring up the summer of 2018 where you were on a caffeine high? Matt won't get off my back ever since back in 2018, he slipped a few drops of Red Bull in my drink. I was blacked out for days. You know, Easton, I don't need to take this crap. You know what, Matt? Fine. Beat it. Have fun in H-E double hockey sticks. That's right. I spelt it. Little does Easton know that it was my caffeinated drink all along. This week on Rexburg Drama. Bad news for the boys. I just matched with a complete 10 on Mutual. Looks like they're going to have to fend for themselves for the night because I'm going out. She told me to wear my I Heart New York shirt so we can more easily find each other at Soda Vine. Well, sorry bros. Looks like you're on your own for the night. I'm matched with a complete 10 on Mutual. What the heck, bro? Catch me on the flip side. Yeah. Dude, hey, yo, dude, where are you going, dude? I matched with a girl on Mutual. Bro, wait. What? But she told me. She told me. Ah! I guess this is a good time to tell them that I have a Catfish Mutual account. This week on Rexburg Drama. So I just found out that Easton has a Snapchat streak with Trixie, our new FAG sister. The only problem is that I like her. Just heard that you have a Snapchat streak with Trixie. I call dibs on her. You're never going to date her. Dude, me and Trixie are forever. Don't be mad and be hating because we got a five day streak. Shut up, dude. You're just jealous because I have a longer streak with your mom. Matt claims I broke the bro code, but he never properly called dibs and Frankly, I swooped in there where I could. Easton thinks he has a better Snapchat score than me, but little does he know that I'm a swooper off her feet via Snapchat. Hey bro, where are you going? Oh, I'm just going with some friends right now. Little does Matt and Easton know that me and Trixie have been dating for three days. This week on Rexburg Drama. Just got off the phone with the Modesty Police. Matt's been wearing shorts. It's hard when the devil's in your own home. All right, guys, I'm calling an emergency apartment council. Matt, I'm gonna be straight up. I know you've been wearing shorts. Uh, Matt, how could you? I trusted you. <laughs> Matt was like a brother to me. We used to go drive to church together and everything. Now I don't know what to do. You know the rules. Pack your stuff, be out by the morning. Oh. It was swim class. I was walking to the effing pool. <laughs> this week on Rexburg Drama. Trouble in the parking garage. Just found Ted Bundy's car. This can only mean one thing. Oh, it's Ted Bundy's car. There's only one. Oh, no. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, I can't do it anymore. Oh, it's Ted Bundy's car. Whoa. That was late. You were amazing. You waited until the fourth or fifth to say, you just all that anger by saying you're two and a half, four, you put it on and say, you suck. I don't, I don't have time for this. I can't wait all day for his mood swings. I quit, Easton. This week on Rexburg Drama. Big trouble. My parents are coming over for the weekend to the apartment, and we have to whip this place into shape. Come on, guys, this place is a mess. Clean it up. What the heck is going on in here, Easton? What the heck? Why is this dirty? My parents are coming up. Oh, what's up? Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Why? Oh, Why is it dirty like this? bro? What's up with this place? This is so dirty. What are you doing? This is the face. Get out of here. Whose drugs are these? My parents can't know that we're using this. Nobody's done the f***ing dishes. Maybe it's best if my parents don't come over. This week on Rexburg Drama. 
I distinctly made 16 cookies, and there's only 15 here. There is gonna be beep to pay for the missing cookie. Enrique, we need to talk. I know you ate that cookie. I don't know what you're talking about, bro. Like, I haven't had any of these cookies. Bro. Enrique, you're gonna make me say it. Go ahead, say it. Fetch. Yeah, that's right. And I don't have to repent about it. I confess I did do it. <laughs> I did eat the cookie. Enrique's a softy. I knew he'd fall for that. I had my fingers crossed the whole time. So ladies and gentlemen at home, don't worry. No one actually said that. Hope you enjoyed it. Merry Christmas and God bless you.